Okay, bye. And the McCann. Goodbye. We got them all. Welcome back to Forza Horizon 4. Would you look at that? It is suddenly changing color. Every- I've uh, fallen off the cliff. Welcome to autumn in Forza Horizon 4. The trees are orange, water is everywhere, and more importantly, for today, it's a muddy season here in autumn. So, I wanted to start today off and start this autumn season off by doing something a little muddy and a little dirty. So, I've got this very, very special Porsche Cayenne, which you cannot actually buy. It's one of the exclusive cars in Forza Horizon 4 that you can only get by getting it from a wheel spin, and somehow I got it. So I was like, well, why don't we try that today? There is only one from 2012, which is it's a pretty cool one, pretty nice. However, very, very early on in our Let's Play series, I got from a wheel spin this one, the 2018 Porsche Cayenne Turbo. And I was like, hey, I love my McCann. You guys have heard me go on and on and on about my McCann. So why don't we try to make a Cayenne as well? I mean, it's it's pretty cool looking. It comes in blue. It has a Wang, which does some cool things. Can I get it to... Yeah, look at the Wang gang. Let's see. I'm really hoping and crossing fingers because I haven't gone in here and looked. Please, please have a... Doesn't have a wide body kit. Does it have anything? Why doesn't this have an off-road body kit? Nope. Well, that's enough of that. All right. That's the Porsche Cayenne. That's, um, that's enough. Cool. A lot of people are saying to take out the, where is Lamborghini? The Urus. Yeah, I think the Urus would be pretty good. I think we'll be able to turn this into quite the off-roader. I mean, it's the 2014 Urus, so it's still like the concepty car looking one. We'll see if there's anything nice available for this. We'll come back to the paint job. Okay, I promise we will turn this thing into a pretty cool looking car. So, upgrades and tuning, custom upgrades. Here we go. Wide body kit for the Urus. Thank you very- That actually makes it so wide. Look at that lift kit too. Wow. Well played game. So what engine do we got? We've got the stock engine, which I don't know what it is. Or we can toss in a V10, I would assume... That's the 5.2 liter from the Hurricane. Do we go a Hurricane powered Lamborghini Urus? Eh, why not? You can't go wrong with a with Lambo stuff. And some twin turbos to make it underground racy style. All right, what do we got? Oh, we got the bull bar. I really like the bull bar. It covers up a lot of like the Lamborghini cool looking stuff, but I, I think it works on this. It looks pretty cool. Then we should have some very nice chunky off-road tires. That looks so crazy. There's a there's a flaw with this car. It's an off-roader slash SUV, and it's got 24-inch rims. That would be awful to off-road on, like, in real life. What you'd want to do in real life is make the rims smaller so you got more tire. Oh, wait, that's tire width. <laughs> My bad. All right, please tell me you can make it smaller. Yes, you can go all the way down to 18s. That's what I'm talking about, game. But it's gonna be pretty du Oh my god, we can lift it up even more. Rally suspension, we go even higher. Oh my god, proper off-roader. Oh my god. Boys, this is gonna be ridiculous. This is gonna be a thousand horsepower. Oh my god, it's over a thousand horsepower. I mean, at least in the game, it's, it's not the nicest looking thing. Maybe in real life, it's different. I've never seen a Urus in real life, but... I don't know, I feel like in real life it would look pretty cool, honestly. It does actually look like Batman. Oh my god. Boys, that looks insane. Black wheels? No, we need we need carbon wheels as well. Hell yes. Blacked out windows, hell yes. Say hello to the Batmobile. Look at it, it looks so crazy. Oh, I like this car, okay. So, we've got some things that we've not done in a little while. We've got the Dirt Racing series, and the cross-country racing series. Now, I see here, if I level up to the next level of the cross-country series, I get a Jeep Trackhawk. So, let's go do some more races and see what we got, boys. Let's go. This going off-road is gonna look so dope. Let's go. Oh, welcome to runny- runny? Rainy- up, uh, dumb. Try that again. Rainy fall. 
I meant autumn. All right. Oh, look how dope it looks off-road. All right. Are any of the AI gonna be rocking the new wide body kit? So this is a thousand horsepower, hurricane powered. I'm gonna call it the Batmobile just because it looks so. Yeah. Okay, we should watch out for trees still. It is pretty beastly, but. You know, can't take down all the types of trees. So, hardest difficulty, we haven't done some off-roading in a while. That Tureg's gone. He's gone. Oh, hard landing. It's a good thing we raised this thing up. Oh, there's another Urus. Watch out. Bumpy, bumpy. Oh, man. I don't know how we're still in third place. Come on. Pass the Range Rover. Oh, my God. My gears. I didn't tune this car. Running wide. Yeah, it's still a bit heavy. Let's go, more jumps. Holy crap, we're running through the stream. Come on, get out of here. Round the inside of the Range Rover. Push him wide. Come on, there's not long left in this race. Look how muddy it is in the uh, fall. Autumn. <laughs> I keep saying the wrong season. I don't know why. Okay. Sheep! Sheep, watch out for the new Batmobile. Maybe they're- are they- aren't they working on a new Batman? Maybe they should just use this. This would be dope. <laughs> this is so cool, boys. So, so cool. Ugh. Keep it straight. We're in second. I don't know where the guy... Please tell me we finished second. Yes! Yes! <laughs> we got second. I don't know how that other Urus beat us by six seconds. But damn, he's quick. How's the money from that? 13k? Not too bad overall. Influence, I, that's really, really bad. Three and a half thousand. We're gonna go do some co-op races. Does anyone want to come play? Because this is gonna take a while. Let's go do some co-op races, boys. You forgot the most important part. The guns that go boom on the Batmogini. Batmogini. <laughs> that's a good name. Welcome to the Batmogini in the Urus. All right, while we wait for everybody to go and join... You know what I want to do? Um, why do I have nothing? Okay, hold on. Why do I have nothing on my screen? There we go. While we're here, danger sign off the biggest mountain in the game. What could possibly go wrong with that? All right, the danger sign is over there. I feel like if I come ripping it down this hill, I could jump super, super far. All right, here we go, Urus. Come on, do me proud. Bring me- Okay, we, we, we missed the danger sign, buddy. The Urus is the epitome of off-roading. It's true. Here we go, boys. Here we go. Three stars. Come on, give me three. Oh, that's way not fast enough. Come on, Urus. I expected more from you. Wait, there's someone there. Oh, hello. Two stars. All right, Urus, here's a fun fact. In case you didn't know, you could hit danger signs going this way, too. Is that going to be better? No, that's worse. God damn it. Well, I tried. We are only, I would imagine, one more race away from unlocking that Jeep tra tra trail cat? Or is it track? I think it's a track hawk, actually. Any money-making method? I posted a video on the channel about how to make money in the game. AR-12 Nick versus Team Drivatar. We got this. You need to race well. Oh, I think some of you guys have taken- Yes, yeah, some of you guys- Or one of you guys have taken my car. Good stuff. Aw, oh, shit. Okay, never mind. My telemetry now opens instead of closing the big thing on the right-hand side of the screen. Turn! Turn! Come on, I'm supposed to be good at off-roading. Okay, what the hell just happened to that Jeep in front? It got, like, unlimited grip. Okay, he spun. Okay, the Durango's also glitching in first. That was a- very strong golf cart. Okay, the Durango's gone. What the hell is going on this race? Boys, I think playing online is a little- uh -oh. oh my god, I just landed on my teammate. Sorry, Range Rover, man. Keep it going. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. We got this. Yep. All good. The Bentayga died as it hit the golf cart. I don't know. There's something strange that happens when you play this game online. I, I, I don't understand what it is, but it becomes very good. Uh, what the hell is this? Okay, there's two different ways for us to go. Interesting. Come on, Range Rover man. Blue team is winning right now, but not by very much. We gotta keep up the pace, bro. Oh, I'm running wide. Oh, I'm bouncing off the train tracks. I'm all over the place. Come on. Don't hit those, don't hit those. They slow you down. We're good. We're good. Big jump. 
Oh, the Urus beats out a ray. I mean, the bat, the bat, bat mobile. Mini tumbler. What do we call it? Oh, I've missed the checkpoint. I've ruined it. Going back. Come on, blue team. We're doing pretty good. We can do better, though. Not long left. Come on. Get the Bentega. Come on, Batmobile. Bruce Wayne would not be pleased. Oh, Bruce Wayne's got to get a new goddamn car. He got smushed. I got, I got destroyed. There we go. We get the Jeep. I think it was a Trackhawk. Trackhawk. Yes, it is. Okay, perfect. We've been saying the right car all along. And we get a wheel spin. Come on, game. You got to be nice to me. We're getting a Forza Edition right here. Right now. Nope. If you make it through this next round, I can promise you something big. Really big. Like, four teams of Horizon Scouts working around the clock for two months. Big. <laughs> Stand by. Thank you, man. Okay, cool. I've heard that there's also a very, very cool wide body for this. So, I'm sorry, Batmobile. But we gotta go try out the brand new car, too. That's gonna be dope. Trail caught Trailhawk or Track Cat? <laughs> We're just gonna start naming new cars for Jeep, okay? This is now the Track Cat, and this is the Trail Hawk. All right, so again, we've got all the same sort of like off-roadiness. Hell yeah, that's what I like to see. I like this car a lot. Like it's it's cool, really cool. We can go do some like dirt races. They're I mean they're not as off-roady extreme like as the as the cross country races are, but. I do quite like the dirt races, so let's give them a go. Let's do this one right up here. All right, boys. Here we go. Trackhawk, one of the other very, very rare... What? Why is my team ghost? One of the other very rare cars in Forza Horizon 4 that I assume a lot of people don't know how to get. Currently up on the website, we have a whole, we have a whole article to show you guys how to get all of the exclusive cars like the R34, um, what else is on that list? There's a Hummer, the limo, this, a bunch, bunch, bunch of cars. So if you want to know how to get any of those, go check out the list on the website. It will probably help out. I'm just saying. How's our team doing? I can't really look up right now. Okay. Oh, we're losing. We're losing by like 500 points. We got to go. Oh my God. What the hell? The AI just blitzed it past me. And then my whole car, like, freaked out a bit. I'm telling you, something funky is going on in these online lobbies. It almost feels like the AI has a monster advantage. I don't really... Okay, never mind. They just both wreck. And this guy shoots up the... Into... See how he goes out of the corner? He almost, like, pops in front of me. All right, we got to be doing a little better than this, though. We're not doing that well. Maybe we should have brought out the Batmogini. DJ says the online races are rigged, and I cannot believe I'm saying that. They, they feel weird, right? They, they feel like... They feel rigged. Like, the two guys crash. Suddenly, two more guys come fly past me. It's strange. It's just weird, because usually I'm really good at, like, the off-roading thing. Like I've, like I've said throughout this Let's Play. But, for some reason, it's like, I'm just sitting back here in 7th place. I can't even see the guy who's in front of me. The guy behind me is sort of pestering me to try to get past. And there's, there's really not much that I can do. Okay. No, no, no. Okay, we're on the same team, bro. We're on the same team. Sure, take seven. Just don't... What? Did you just break on the finish line to let me go past? Is that what just happened? Oh. Yeah, so everybody else was S1 class and I was A class, so... That might have something to do with it, but that was definitely a little weird. DJ says Drivatars have managed world records, so... I can't say they suck. Oh my god, we got 17,000 credits for that one race. That was really good. Whoa, 9,000 influence. So it's like, either you can play with fair AI and earn no money, or you can get a lot of money, but the AI just sort of glitches past you. It's weird. Let's do one more. I'm I'm interested about my theory now. Where's another dirt race? There's one, one all the way down here. Uh, no, we don't want to do that one. Let's do this one over here. Okay, everybody's taking my car, except for actually the two guys on the far left there. For some reason, they're in the same car as me, but without the bull bar. All right, let's go, boys. We got to smash the AI this time. No more spooky AI. We got to go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Okay, there's a... Okay, the Bentayga is sort of glitching around. This guy... Please don't push me into the wall. Please don't push me into the wall. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I saw that. I saw you. I saw the attempt. 
The attempt was made, Bentega, bye bro. Anyways, look at this race. We are losing again. But it definitely feels like the AI isn't cheating as much. Almost, I hey, Nathan, what are you doing? Oh, the BM. Okay, bye, and the McCann, goodbye. We got them all. Look at this, I'm up into third place. Onto the podium position. I'm just saying this did, Oh, This did say it was a dirt race. The first half of this race has been on- Oh, are we finally going off-road? Here we go. About time game. What are we doing? Oh, oh, the AI's crashed into the Durango. Come on, I'm in the wrong gear. Shit. Okay, who used the horn? Nathan, what up? The sheep horn lives. Yeah, here's a, here's a Windows XP shout sound for you. That just lets people know we're coming. Probably gonna crash into them. There we go. We nailed it. Turn. We're good. All right, Nathan, we got 2-3 right now. We are winning for blue team. Just, just please don't hit a tree, Nathan. Nathan, remember to break for the corner and go through the checkpoint. Please tell me you got that. I assume you did. If I need to, I will weave into him and I will kill him. I was Batman not five minutes ago. I know how to murder. I mean, not murder. I mean, knockout. Sorry. My skills aren't going to be half. Uh, what? The word stuff and things. Third. Yes. For some reason. Creating my own blueprint race made the AI much, much more fair. Like, it didn't even seem like they were cheating. Oh, man, look at the influence. 10,000 from one race. We nearly go up to 185 in one race. We get an off-road team. And now we're on way to another chat message. We got a new event. It's called the Gauntlet. You may have seen this one because, well... Raymond and I used it in a challenge because Raymond ruined my Let's Play, but the gauntlet is coming up soon. Oh my god. Oh, that's gonna be so dope. I'm so pumped for the gauntlet. It's perfect to do it in the middle of autumn as well. That is, that is so good.